Hey y'all. Uh, I've re I had a request from uh, a YouTube user uh, Hicktown125, and uh, he wanted me to teach you all uh, Big Green Tractor. Um, I don't know if he just wants the licks or the chords or whatever, but I'm just gonna do both parts. All right. Uh, for first, first and foremost, you need to be in standard tuning. Tuning. Then you put uh, capo on the second fret. Um, the capo is not relevant if you're just going to be playing this. Uh, sorry. If you're just going to be playing that part. Because uh, you will get uh, the same exact result without the capo. But if you're if you're playing this and you're uh, doing the chords, to, then you're gonna need the capo. Um, I really recommend playing this on electric guitar with the on the neck pickup with uh, a compressor and a little bit of overdrive, not a lot. Or it I mean it's kinda got the it's kinda got a clean sound, but there's still a little dirt on it. So uh here we go. I'll get down to teaching it to you now. I'll play the first lick. Excuse me. Alright, it starts out on the ninth fret. Well, yeah. The we're just not gonna use the yeah. We're just gonna uh, the capo is not relevant. It'll just be the ninth fret. Okay, so the ninth fret. Then you hit the eleventh uh, fret of the G, and you bend it up twice. Then you do this thing called a rake. It's really cool when you get used to it. Alright, uh, and, uh, what it is, this rake is on the, uh, B string on the 12th fret. Okay, what you're doing is you're you're kind of just they're hard, it's hard to explain, sort of. But uh, you're you're basically like making the strings that you're gonna hit before it dead, so you get a little bit of an extra effect. Then you then you hit the uh, you'll hit the 12th fret on the B, so you. I didn't explain that well enough. Uh, I'm sure there's a video on YouTube that teaches you how to do a rake that would get more into it. So, and I can't do them anymore. Okay, now you're going to bend up from the 11th fret of the G. Then you're gonna hammer on from the 9th fret to the 11th fret. And then you're going to hit the 9th fret. Then you're going to pull off from the uh, I mean, you're going to hit the 10th fret. And you're going to pull off from the 10th fret. Excuse me, the 11th fret. You're going to hit the 11th fret. And then you're going to pull off from the 11th fret to the 9th fret. Now you're gonna Alright. Now you're gonna 
bend up from the 11th fret again. Then you're going to pull off from the 11th fret to the 9th fret and do that twice. Then hit the 11th fret on the D string. Then hammer on from the 9th fret to the 11th fret on the D string. And hit the 9th fret on the G twice. Alright, so, so far we have... Alright, uh, that's the intro. Uh, let's go into the chords now. Uh, she had a shiny little beamer with a ragtop down. Sitting in the drive, but she couldn't get out. The dogs were all barking and wagging around. And I just laughed to see you all get in. She had okay, uh, it's a D, your palm mute. Throughout the verse, you really want to palm mute. And then be a D. Um, then an A. Then a B minor. And a G. Then an A. So that would go, you'd do that twice, I think. Let me see. Yeah, the shit. Dogs are on barking and wagging around. And I just laughed, said, Y'all get in. She had on her new dress and she curled her hair. She was looking too good not to go somewhere. Yeah, what you wanna do, baby? I don't want to. We can go to the show, we can stay right here. Yeah, you do that twice. And then the course would be. I'm gonna take you for a ride on my big green tractor We can go slow, or maybe go faster Down through the woods, and out through the pasture As long as I'm with you, it really don't matter if I'm a fin Okay, uh, it's a D, these you're not gonna palm me, you're gonna be a D tractor, A Go faster, you might Alright, uh, that's that part. And then after that you go back into the lick, but it it's a little different. It goes Excuse me. Then I forgot the lick. Oh my god, I forgot the lick. Okay, so it's... Alright, it's, uh, the beginning part is the same as what I taught you in the, uh, uh, beginning. Uh, I'll remember it in a minute, but I can't remember it now. But then it goes... Then you're gonna bend up from the, uh, 12th fret on the B. Then the 11th fret on the G. Then it goes go. Then it goes in. Uh, we fired up and I can show you around. I sit upon the hill more. And the chords repeat. Okay, uh, that's all I have time for now. So uh, there'll be a next video.